Ghana is stepping up efforts to add nuclear power to the country's energy mix. The Ghana Atomic Energy Commission believes that nuclear power will help the country attain energy sufficiency. Local and foreign experts met in Accra to trade ideas to achieve this goal. The nuclear power project, with an estimated cost of 5 to 6 billion US dollars per 1,000 megawatts, is expected to be completed by 2029. In May 2007, the government of Ghana conceded the potential use of nuclear energy to generate power to permanently solve the perennial electricity crisis in the country. This subsequently led to the formation of the Ghana Nuclear Power Program in 2012, mandated to spearhead the development of the Nuclear Power Program to make a move Local and foreign energy experts have met in Accra to provide suggestions and recommendations to achieve the set targets. The Director General of the Ghana Atomic Energy Commission, Professor Benjamin Nyakum, said the program will help solve the problems in Ghana's energy sector and help reduce the country's greenhouse gas emissions. We are encouraged by the vision of our first president, the support the government is giving us the enthusiasm of our stakeholders, the prospective jobs that the, the nuclear power will, will create, and the contribution the program will make to the reduction of the country's greenhouse emissions. I dare say that we simply cannot disappoint with the second opportunity to add nuclear energy to our energy mix. The head of the Nuclear Infrastructure Division for the International Atomic Energy Agency, Mr. Doi Hun, said his team is ready to support Ghana to develop a safe, secure and sustainable nuclear power infrastructure. The IAEA has assembled a team of highly experienced experts and they have also prepared extensively. I would like to assure you that the agency stands ready to assist Ghana throughout the process of considering the introduction of nuclear power. The conference focused on the first phase of the program, which involved the preparation of a report on all the International Atomic Energy Agency identified nuclear infrastructure issues.